Hey, how's it going everybody? Sean Allen here. This is another college video here at Los Angeles Valley College. This is part three of my little Valley College video series and this right here, right behind me, is the first building that I ever got to you know, go into during my first semester here at Los Angeles Valley College. And it was also here where I recorded a small video about me graduating. It was kind of an emotional experience for me because, you know, graduation is is pretty cool so anyways without further ado here's the video and I hope you enjoy it well here it is guys there used to be a sign up here saying this was the life science building and all they got now is just the little thing taped up here to the door it says formerly life science building what do you guys think that's right judge Sean Allen is here for to work as a judge <laughs> yeah can you see my reflection I don't know if you can, you can kind of see it right there. It's time for me to walk over to Monarch Hall. So yeah, the room is right here. That's 107. That's where I took my very first class right there. I wish we can go in there, but unfortunately we can't. Check it out, I got one of these for because I'm in the honors club. That's pretty cool. I even got an upgrade on the tassel. Check it out. <laughs> okay, 2012, let's hear it from you guys. Yeah! All right, congratulations once again. With that said, I'd like to introduce our college president, Dr. Sue Carlio. Thank you, Raul. You know, this is the fun part. This is the big payoff for all of your hard work. And this is the best party that Valley College gives all year. And you're the invited guests. And you've earned it. And so in a few minutes, not too long from now, we're going to march out onto the field. And we're going to have a commencement ceremony. And when you leave that field, you will be graduates. So I just wanted to come in here and wish you all the best in a more informal setting to let you know we're very proud of all the hard work that you've done to get to this day. Your family and friends are going to be in the stands cheering you on and the faculty are going to be there cheering you on as are all of we. And so we're just really proud of you. As Mr. Castillo said, stay connected with us. We love hearing about how great you will, will turn out in your career goals the things that you will do when you leave the college and many of you we would love to have you come back and tell the students who are here in the future what it was like to be here in the good old days so I'm going to see you on the field we're going to march out it's a little formal but also remember there's a lot of joy and excitement because of all of the great things you've done while you've been here at the college so congratulations Yay. <laughs> Okay, guys, we're going to be heading out to the stadium right now. When Sims was saying, there we go. Let's go. So now it's the long trek to the stadium. Yikes. <laughs> That's assignment. There you go. There it is. Life science building right there. There they all are up there at the stadium. There's not that many people up there. <sighs> oh boy. <laughs> thank you. You're welcome. Oh, thank you. Ooh. Stinky's flying my head. Ow. Ow. So anyway, for now just gonna sit here. I'm gonna oh, yeah. sit here roasting See, look. In the sun. See, look. <laughs> I don't know how long we've been standing here, but <laughs> finally, here we go. I can't tell where the, my parents are right now, so I'm just gonna guess. I spotted them. There's Dad, right over there, right next to the umbrella. Class of 2012. This is it. This is it. Woo! Woo! 
We are about to begin your commencement. And when we leave the stadium, in just a little over an hour from now, you will be graduates. Before we begin, I want to take a moment to introduce the platform party so that you will know who is here to help make this oh my gosh, commencement no, happen. First of all, you've just met Norvon Barkesian, our ASU student body president. In a little while, you will hear from Cynthia Whitlock, our student speaker today. Uh -huh. yeah, yeah. We'd like to thank Robert Oberstein, who is the president of the Los Angeles Valley College Foundation and a graduate of Los uh -huh. Angeles Valley College for being here with us. And many thanks to our Vice President, Tom Jacobsmeyer, Vice President of Administrative Services. Yay. Our Academic Senate President, Joshua Miller, who you will hear from in a little while. Our trustee today, representing the Board of Trustees of the Los Angeles Community College District, is Student Trustee Brandon Baffin. Our Vice President of Academic Affairs, who you will hear from later, is Dr. Sandy Mayo. Yeah! <laughs> Representing the Chancellor today is the Executive Assistant to the Chancellor, Ms. Perrin Reed. She will bring greetings to us. <laughs> and our Vice President of Student Services, Mr. Florentino Manzano. Woo! Tino! It's also my pleasure to recognize the faculty who are participating in our ceremony today. Without their help, we could not do this. And first, let me introduce, for those of you who don't know them, Professors Jun Miyazaki and Michael Arshaguri. And our marshals today, Tiffany Lanois, Tiffany Snyder, Deidre Stark, and Al Zucker. Thank you all. So graduates, it won't be long now. You have completed a very important phase of your education. And I congratulate you and your family and your friends. You stuck with it and you made it. I want to share with you a little bit about your class, the class of 2012. First of all, there are 833 of you who are graduating today. Wow. And many of you are actually here today, which is really terrific. Our oldest graduate today is 71. Amazing. And learning is truly a lifelong endeavor. Hmm. Our youngest graduate is 18. Well on the way with a long career to look forward to. Four of you actually completed your studies at Valley College with a 4.0 grade point average. Wow. That's amazing. That's perfection, in case you didn't know. As a class, you represent students from many successful fields of study. And the three departments that have the most graduates graduating this year are child development, mm. liberal arts, and nursing. Wow. <laughs> we are also honored today to have nine veterans graduating. We salute you for your service to our country. One of our graduates, Eric Mendoza, is actually right at this moment on active duty in Afghanistan. That's it! Yeah! First of all, I hope it's hot enough for you. My speech is only going to be about two hours, so get comfortable. Oh no. My name is Josh Miller and I am the Academic Center President here at Valley College. I attended Valley College 20 years ago and I have to admit, when I was taking classes in those bungalows 20 <laughs> years ago that still exist now, I still can't believe they exist. They're supposed to be torn yeah. down in 2013, it's not gonna happen. But I never ever once thought that I'd be standing here delivering a speech as Academic Senate President. I'm so proud to be here. I mean, uh, somebody that was my professor 20 years ago, he's here now, he's my friend, he's my mentor. I've taken over his office, it's fantastic. Wayne <laughs> uh, Smith, he was a, uh, a peer of mine. We competed here at Valley College 20 years ago. Now we're both instructors here and now people compete for us on the speech team. He's here, it's a fantastic experience. I'm proud to be here and I'm also very proud of all of you. 
When I pondered the speech, I wondered, where do I start? Where do I find the right words, that pithy thing to say to change all of your lives? Because that's the point of these speeches. Um, how do I comment on global awareness and conservation, which is our theme for, the, for today? Do I tell you all to eat less meat because cow gas causes global warming? Now, I have to tell you, originally I was going to say cow farts, but I was told by Jim Martini not to say that because that would be inappropriate, so I did not. Sometimes inspiration is there. You just need to look really around your feet. Recently, I read a story about a woman who, while in line at a McDonald's, saw people throw trash out their car window. Mm. This woman said something to them, and the people got out of their car and beat her severely over litter. And last week, I was driving down Lancashire, and I saw a woman with two children standing on a corner. She had a bottle of something and threw it on a small patch of grass. I looked at that grass and noticed that there was a bunch of other trash. This saddened me because not only was she dirtying our community, she was setting an example for her children. So what's the point of these stories? Well, this leads me to my charge. My charge to all of you is to stop littering. <laughs> Obviously, literally, yes, but uh, please clean up when you tra your trash when you leave. I really appreciate that. But there's a more important lesson here. It's a metaphor, and hopefully, as college graduates, you all know what metaphors are. You should. Uh, hopefully, you know that. <laughs> this is about the metaphorical litter that pollutes our lives. Those things we just throw around us that make the world a little less beautiful. Littering is not just an act. It's also a mindset. My good friend and poet Derek Brown wrote that we are everywhere. Our actions are everywhere. When we litter, treat people poorly, have negative attitudes, we make the world a little less beautiful. When we hurt those around us, we create fear and chaos. A few weeks ago, a student from Yale University, Marina Keegan, wrote, it's not quite love, and it's not quite community. It's just this feeling that there are people, an abundance of people, who are in this together. Marina died in a car accident not long after she wrote those words. But those words serve to remind us that we have a responsibility as a global community to stop littering. And graduating from Valley College is only the first step in all of you recognizing this responsibility. We are all in this together. When we appreciate and are thankful, we create joy and a positive sense of self and community. Spend a moment today to be thankful for what you have, for what Valley College have, has given you, because this is something spectacular and special. Very, very few people graduate with degrees, and all of you are doing this, and you should be very proud of yourselves. But you also need to take a moment to recognize and be thankful to your friends and family members who supported you, and that moment is now. So I want all of you graduates to stand up and face that way. And on the count of three, you're going to give me a big, solid, resounding thank you. You ready? One, two, three. Thank you! <laughs> the important body of people here that we need to recognize. Will all the faculty members please rise? Yeah. We should all be thankful for that. We don't realize how hard they work, yeah. what they go through. We have some we have some people here that are retiring that, you know, we will never never see them again. But they've been here for 15, 20, 25, 30, 35 years. They have dedicated so much time and effort into all of you, and they've changed thousands of people's lives. Hmm. These people right here have made the world a better place, and all of you need to show your appreciation to them. Count of three. One, two, three. <laughs> Thank you, Captain Travis. I love you. <laughs> now, all of you, go out there as Valley College graduates and clean up the world. <laughs> On the recommendation of the faculty and by the virtue of the authority vested in me by the Board of Trustees of the Los Angeles Community College District, I confer upon you the degrees of Associate in Arts and Associate in Science. Congratulations, Class of 2012. <laughs> Congratulations. Thank you. Thank you very much. Congratulations. Will all the graduates please rise?
seat for just a few more moments. <laughs> what? Graduates, your family and friends will meet you out in the reception area for photos and hugs once we depart with our recessional. But graduates, there is one more thing you must do today. Oh boy. In recognition of your accomplishments, I now authorize you to wear the tassel of your cap on the left side of your cap. I'm a graduate, baby. Here we go. station. Yeah, there, there's mom. I see her waving right there. I see you. I see you. <laughs> ah. I've been attacked. Ah. Whoa. What's up? Man, I've got a super big headache right now. the graduation part. And this heat's not helping. <laughs> Whoops, your tassel. Oh, is that yep. mine? Yep. Uh, your hair's in my Congratulations. face. Congratulations. Congratulations, this, buddy. This tassel thing is like getting in my face. It, it's like several times throughout the, the ceremony, it kept blowing in my face. I'm like, I started to eat it at one point. It was just, it was just ridiculous. And this is it. And with that, you guys, that is the end of my graduation from Los Angeles Valley College. That was filmed on June 6, 2012. I don't know if you saw in the video, but this is the brochure that was given to me. In the midsection, it has here candidates for associate and arts degree. Spring 2012, there I am. Actually, my name appears twice in here because honors with associate's degree, cum laude. There I am again, which is pretty cool. This is just unbelievable, but this was literally five years ago. After I graduated, I basically stayed for another year because I still needed to work on a few more of my GE courses. But the reason why I graduated was because I finished all my core classes for my associate's degree and the GE didn't really have to apply the rest of the GE, so that's what happened. It took me four years to get my associate's degree and then an extra year to leave for good Valley College and I was transferred to CSUN. Now, when I was taking my last semester at Valley, that was also the same semester that I started taking courses at CSUN. So it was kind of hard juggling two classes. Actually, it was three classes at the same time from two different colleges. That was fall 2013 when I started going to CSUN and my last semester at Los Angeles Valley College. This is my associate's degree. Over here is the cap that I wore. This is my original tassel right here. This is the one I put on the cap. There's the gold sash right there. It's on Professor Ward's set. And there it is. My associate's degree. Los Angeles Valley College. The Los Angeles Community College District Board of Trustees on the recommendation of the Los Angeles Valley College faculty has conferred upon Sean Michael Allen the degree of Associate in Arts, Media Arts, cum laude, this fourth day of June 2012. Yes, I know, this was two days before I graduated. And up here, behind my soda bottle there, is my Phi Theta Kappa Honor Society Award, and my transfer achievement right there. And this hat is the hat I wore over at, at Valley in my vlogs. It's back on the display with my alumni pins 
and my presidential honors pin. And with that, you guys, that concludes my days at Los Angeles Valley College. I might talk briefly about them, my like my last semester in my CSUN vlogs, but that won't happen until next time when I talk about CSUN. And it's crazy to think that this happened five years ago. I know I mentioned this earlier, earlier, but um, this happened five years ago, and right now, literally next month, I will be graduating with a bachelor's degree in multimedia production at Cal State Northridge. It's coming down to the end here, which is pretty crazy to think about. I just want to say something. I know I'm not one to be prideful, okay? I needed help constantly throughout my days at Valley, and I still do at CSUN. Still have. Um, couldn't have done any of this without my folks, my friends, my professors, my instructors, anybody that was involved in my classes. And sometimes I don't show my appreciation that much. Um, and I know some of my viewers are some of my former professors and, you know, uh, uh, students that I've known for the last eight years. So thank you guys so much for helping me get through all this. It really, really does mean a lot. Let me just say something here. Um, even though I'm showing you guys how I graduated, this could also be you. You could be out there graduating, but you got to put in the time, the energy, and a lot of brain power to get where I got there. And yes, it doesn't take two seconds. It doesn't take an hour. It took me four years to get that associate's degree. And it's taken me another four years to get this bachelor's degree. And it wasn't easy. It was very hard. A lot of that stuff that uh, I thought I knew, I didn't. I had to learn some of it by scratch, some of it by memory. But a lot of that stuff that I learned, you know, was brand new. What I'm showing you with these vlogs, my school and college videos and university videos, this can be you too if you just put in that time, if you work hard. I can't tell you how many times I have seen videos of people literally basically telling the world they are not going to work. That they are not going to, you know, do something to get their butts off the sofa and be productive. Like, they're basically admitting that they are lazy and they don't care. They're going to really care when they can't support themselves. They think that other people are going to support them. Well, maybe one of these days, they're going to smell the coffee and they're going to start shoveling. I don't want to have that happen to you guys. I want this to be an inspiration to you guys so that you can get out there and get the job done. If you're in school right now, if you're in high school, if you're in college, keep at it. Don't stop. Because you're not going to get these opportunities ever again. There may be times where you may stop and say, oh, I'll continue later on. You do not know where the future is going to take you. You don't know what's going to happen to you in the next two minutes, what's going to happen the next hour, the next day. We can think, but it might change the next day. It's like the weather. It's unpredictable. So guys, do the right thing and study hard. So, anyways. I'm going to go now. Thank you so much for watching. If you guys like these videos, hit the thumbs up button. It is greatly appreciated. Don't forget to check out my other three channels. The Educational Series, the Disneyland Video Series, and the Travel Town Series. And if you haven't seen my previous videos on my special playlist for my schooling days and my college vlogs and all that, Go and check them out. This wasn't easy. Neither was my bachelor's degree, which I'll be getting next month. All right, guys. I'm going to run. Thank you so much for watching. End scene.